my topic for you this morning is from prodigal to promised from prodigal to promised is there any time you were very much worried about your children's spiritual life is there any time you were lost not knowing how to bring back your children to the shadow of the cross is there any time you were really disappointed to see your children stopped coming to church king david felt the same thing as you let us read psalms 115 verse 9 and 10 it says israel trust in the lord he is their help and their shield o house of aaron trust in the lord he is their help and their shield my friends king david was really worried about his own children who didn't understand him and who didn't obey him david was really concerned about his own children who stopped trusting the lord and drifted away from spiritual life my friends is it your experience today are you fasting and praying for your own children's spiritual life today are you really agonizing today because your children are not interested in bible not interested in prayer not interested in any church activity are you really disappointed and crying in your heart today because your children seem losing salvation here is the prophecy for you isaiah chapter 43 verses 5 6 and 7 and it says don't be afraid i am with you i will bring your children from the east and gather you from the west i will say to the north give them up and to the south don't hold them back bring my sons from far and my daughters from the ends of the earth everyone who is called by my name whom i created for my glory whom i formed and made my friends don't give up on your children keep praying for your children keep trying for your children keep admonishing your children your children may be prodigal today but in the name of jesus i tell you tomorrow they are the promised citizens of heaven today i would like to do a dedicatory prayer for all the parents if you are parents please bow your heads and close your eyes for this special and dedicatory prayer i'm going to pray for every parents if your parent praying for your children's salvation please close your eyes with me that i'm going to dedicate you and parents like you dear lord in the name of jesus i ask your presence to be with every parents who are crying in their hearts because of their children's spiritual life children are slowly and steadily drifting away from you o lord as you know please dear lord parents are really broken parents are really devastated because of children let them come back from south let them come back from east let them come back from west let them come back from north and let them come back to the shadow of the cross let them read scriptures let them pray let them come to church and partake in the activities in their church dear lord let them understand the love of god once again please dear lord save them for your glory save them for eternity let their destiny bring glory and honor to you save our children oh lord thank you so much for doing that today they may be prodigal 
but tomorrow with your will with your promises they will be a promise to children of heaven thank you so much once again in jesus mighty name we pray amen and amen god bless you